Go team, go! Justin has the ball. He takes the shot. Yes, one point. And the crowd goes wild! Yay, Justin! Thanks, Gucci. Want to play? We can take turns. Sure! <laughs> My high score is three. Let's see if we can beat it. Your turn, Squidgy. All right, going for number two. Yeah. Yeah. Yes! Two in a row. Go, team, go! Whoa, that's three! I got it, I got it! <laughs> and Justin has the ball again. Huh? Oh. <laughs> go, Justin! It's my turn. Oh, yeah. Sorry, Squidgy. But we still beat the high score. Yeah, I guess you're right. Four, four, we beat the high score. All right, going for number five. Uh-oh. I'll get it. I got it, I got it. I got it, I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Hey, nice catch, Olive. Thanks, Justin. Hi, Squidgy. Hi, Olive. Welcome to ancient Guatemala. This is a Mayan ball court, and we are just about to play a ball game. Awesome! I need a teammate. Want to play? You bet. We're Team Blue. Here's your uniform. Thanks. Do you want to play too, Squidgy? Oh, oh, can I be the cheerleader? Watch this. <laughs> Let's go. Let's play. Hip, 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 hooray! Let's go! Let's play! Hip, hip, hip! Beep, aww, beep, aww. <laughs> Who are you? This is Paco. He's our cheerleader. Oh, hello! I'm Pepe. I'm Paolo. We, we are, are Team Red. Red. Hello! We're, we're team, team Blue! And we're ready to play ball! Okay, Justin, in this game, you score points by getting the ball through the hoop. And the first team to get to five points wins. That I can do. Right, Squidge? Yeah. You can bounce the ball on the ground, on your knees, on your head. You can throw it to another player. And you can use the rams, too. <laughs> Ready to play, Olive? Ready. Game on. Everybody ready? Here we go! Go, Justin! Bonnie! Pepe, here, pass me the ball! Gotcha! Hey. Yes! Oh, nice play, Justin! One point for Team Blue! Game. Way up high, way down low. Nice throw, Justin. Go team. Oh. Oh, you want to cheer with me, Paco? <laughs> Ready? Ready. that gets five points wins. Oh, time for another cheer, Paco! One, two, three, four, my friend Paco says... Five, six, seven, eight, Paco says let's celebrate! Justin intercepts the pass. Good 
at ball games. Me too. What are we going to do? Time to be awesome. <laughs> Find it. Justin. I couldn't have done it without you two. Hey, that's it. Okay, all of Squidgy, team meeting. What's up, Justin? I just figured out what our team needs to do. What, Justin? We need to work together. All of, every time you're open, say, over here. Then I'll pass the ball to you. Right, and every time you're open, you say, over here. Right! And Squidgy, yeah. we need the best cheer ever. All right. Ready? Go Team Blue! Let's get 
some popcorn. Sky high ski jump. Okay, on your mark, get set, go! Okay. We should go for the jump this time, Sammy. Sammy? Hey, what's wrong? Sammy's walking up the middle of the hill. He shouldn't do that. Should he? I don't think so. The rules say you need to use the stairs. See? But Sammy's really far up already. <clears throat> I'm okay! Maybe you we should go up the middle, too. And go for the jump! Yeah, I bet we'd go really high. <gasps> would we fly through the sky? We would if we went off a super ginormous jump. A super ginormous jump on a big mountain? A super ginormous jump on a big, humongous mammoth mountain! Whoa. Look at all this snow, Squidgy. Squidgy? Oh, are you okay? Oh, hey! <laughs> oh, hello. What's your name? That's Benoit, my rescue dog. Hi, Justin. Hey, Squidgy. Olive! <laughs> to the Swiss Alps. Wow. <laughs> Benoit is specially trained to rescue anyone who needs help. Pleased to meet you, Benoit. What are you two doing out here? I'm a ski guide. We are on our way to deliver supplies to the St. Bernard Inn. Down there. Sounds fun. We'll come with you. Sure. Here, you'll need these. Skis? Yes! Look out! Jack Flip. No biggie. Justin, Squidgy, meet Solomon. He's a world famous alpine skier. Everybody just calls me Solly. Nice, nice to, to meet, meet you, you, Solly. <coughs> Are you skiing down this mountain too? Uh, yeah. Great. Then I'll be your guide and get you all down the mountain safely. Solly's a great skier, but he's new to this mountain, so I'm guiding him to the inn. Yeah, I heard these slopes have the biggest jumps. Maybe I can finally land a triple butterscotch twist. Triple butterscotch twist? Mmm, sounds tasty. Yep, I named it myself. It's actually the coolest move ever. Only thing is, I can't find a big enough jump. Well, maybe we can help you find a super big jump. I bet we can. We'll see lots along the way. What are we waiting for? Let's ski! Just a sec. There are some rules for skiing on this mountain. Rules? <laughs> like what? <laughs> Rule number one. Ski together, never alone. Oh, I am always with Justin. <gasps> <laughs> I'm a scarf. Rule number two. Always stay on the trail. Got it. Okay. And one last rule. Look for other signs along the way. Some trails are harder than others, and conditions can always change. Did you get that, Solly? Huh? Oh, yeah. Sure. Are we ready to go now? You bet. Woohoo! All right! Hey, wait for us, Solly! Here we go! Waiting for me. Remember the first rule? 
Ski together, never alone. Woohoo! Come on, keep up, guys! Solly went off the trail. That's bad. Come on, we need to catch up. You know what to do, Benoit. <laughs> Grab on, Solly. Okay, got it. Everyone, pull. <laughs> 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 My jump. Oh, yeah? You did the triple butterscotch twist? Nah, that jump still wasn't big enough. Well, we can keep looking for a bigger jump. As long as we get to the end before it gets dark. All right, break time is over. Let's go! Whoa. Here it is, the last hill before the end. And there's a super huge jump! It's perfect for a triple butterscotch twist. <clears throat> Uh, more rules. Yep. We need to be really careful around here. This sign says it's dangerous to be noisy. So we need to be quiet? Yep, because loud sounds can cause an avalanche. What's an avalanche? That's when a lot of snow comes sliding down the mountain all of a sudden. Like this. Okay, Benoit? <coughs> oh, like that. Uh... I'm okay. <laughs> <laughs> hey, who wants to see my triple butterscotch twist? We do! Justin, Squidgy, wait! All right, here goes nothing. Whoa! Everybody, follow me. I'm gonna go this way. Oh no, where's Solly? He didn't follow rule number one. We need to ski together, not alone. Stay right there, Solly. We'll come rescue you. How, Justin? I have an idea. Remember the rule. We need to be quiet. Oh, mm -hmm, sorry. That was the best jump ever. Solly, you remembered the rule this time. Yeah, I guess I kind of learned the hard way. Um, does this mean we're all stuck here now? Don't worry, Squidgy. That's why we have Benoit with us. Right, Benoit. <laughs> Hop in, everyone. Helping me deliver these supplies, Justin. No problem, Olive. We wouldn't have made it without all those rules to keep us safe. And Benoit's rescue skills. <laughs> Benoit wants you to uncover the sled, Justin. Oh yeah. What did we bring all the way here? Hi, Coco. <laughs> <laughs>
Ready? <laughs> No problem, Sammy. This is why we need to follow the rules. To stay safe. Okay, let's go for the big jump this time. Oh, I'll race you! <laughs> Hot chooks and nook shook. Hmm. You still working on that puzzle, Justin? It's bedtime. I know, but I'm almost finished. Can I stay up just a little bit longer? Okay, you have five more minutes. Then get your PJs on. Wow, you're almost finished. What is it? It's a... Uh, it's a... Uh... Justin? <laughs> Justin! Uh -huh. I'm awake. Ooh, you must be tired. Maybe you need some fresh air. Good idea, Squidgy. It'll help us stay awake to finish this puzzle. Oh, oh, I'll get the window. Whoa! Brrr, it's cold. Yeah, Squidgy. We'll have no problem staying awake now. Hey, these look like doggies. You're right, Squidgy. It's a dog sled. Wouldn't it be great to ride a sled pulled by dogs? That would be awesome. Welcome to Alaska, the land of snow. Wow! Up here, we use dog sleds to get around. Meet Kaya <coughs> and Mikmuk, <coughs> the fastest sled dogs ever. Mush, mush. Mush? It's a special dog sledding word. It means go fast. Ooh! Kaya, Mikmuk, mush, mush! <coughs> That? It's any nookshuk. A statue made of rocks. See how one side is longer than the other? It shows us which way to go. Olive, is that you? A took! Justin, Squidgy, meet my friend a took. Hi. Hi! How's it going, little dudes? So what are you up to, a took? Oh, you know, just chilling, being an artist, and building the biggest Anookshuk ever. The biggest? Yeah, that's right. The biggest. Ever? Ever. Can we help? <laughs> awesome. Give me some mitt. Frosty. Frosty! <laughs> All right, so check this out. I've got the very last slab of rock to finish my biggest Anookshuk ever. How are you going to move that? We can take it on my dog sled. Dudes, that is awesome. That's it. Keep it coming. Put it down. Uh, uh, okay. We're all set. Do you want to drive, Justin? Do I? You bet. So where are we going, Atuk? My favorite place. All you got to do is follow the Anookshooks. Right. Follow the Anookshooks. I'll keep an eye out for them. Squidgy, you can sit with me and be the musher. I get to be the musher! Ready to mush mush? Do you want to ride with us? Thanks, dudes. But I'm going to take some shortcuts through the deep snow. Are you sure? Our dog sled's pretty fast. Oh, don't worry. I've got these snowshoes. I'm a really fast runner. Watch this! So meet you at the first Anookshuk, okay? Sounds good. See you later, Atuk. Mush! Mush! Oh, oh, yeah. hey. <laughs> Stay frosty! Any sign of that Anookshuk, Olive? Hmm. Nothing yet. Oh, little dudes, you made it. 
Make yourself a chair. Rest a while. No thanks, Atuk. We're gonna keep going. Yeah, this is so much fun! <laughs> okay, you sure you're not tired? I'm okay. Anyone else tired? I'm fine. I'm a musher. Mush, mush! <gasps> <Whoa>! <laughs> Ooh, brain freeze. Do you see the next Anikshik, Olive? There it is, down in the forest. Hit it, Squidge. Mush! Mush! Oh, hi, Mikmok. Hi, Kaya. Need a lift? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, that was some radical sledding, little dudes. That was so much fun. How about a break? Remember, to do your best, you need your rest. Thanks, Atuk. We'll rest when we're tired, but we're okay for now. Right, Squidgy? <sighs> I'm a musher. <laughs> All right, you can rest when you get to my favorite place. It's just past this forest. Got it. And that's where we'll see the biggest Anikshik ever? Yup, little dude. You can't miss it. Ooh, I can hardly wait. All right, let's go. See you there, Atuk. Hit it, Squidge. Mush! Mush! <laughs> Bye! See you later. Anookshik yet? Nope. Nothing but snow and trees. Hmm. A took said it's just past this forest. So it can't be that much farther. I hope we get there soon. I'm getting a little tired. Ooh. Hmm. Not me. I'm not tired. I'm not tired at all. Can you smell that? Hot cocoa! Maybe it's coming from those igloos over there. What's an igloo? They're cozy little snow houses. <laughs> cozy snow house. <laughs> Olive, Squidgy sleeping. Whoa, he's really snoring. Wait, that's not Squidgy snoring. It's coming from over there. Hey, those are a Tuck snowshoes. And here's a note. Hey, little dudes. Sorry I couldn't wait up. I was way tired. I built an igloo for you guys. You know, in case you want to rest. It does look cozy. Aw, Mikmuk and Kaya look cozy too. P.S. I left some hot cocoa in the igloo. You know, just in case. Signed, I took. Mm. Hot cocoa. That's right, Squidgy. We're at the igloos. Huh? Oh, we're here! Come on, let's go inside. Mm. Hot cocoa. It sure is yummy. It's so warm and cozy in here. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> Me too, Squidgy. Now let's find that Anookshuk. Hey, what's that? It's the biggest Anookshuk ever! Right on, little dudes. <laughs> you look rested. We feel great! How come we didn't see this last night? We must have been really tired. Like you said, it took. To do your best, you need your rest. And hot cocoa? Thanks for bringing me my rock. No problem, it took. Wait, how are we going to get it way up there? I have an idea. Everyone ready? Ready! Ready! Hit it, Squidge! Kaya! Mikmo! Mush! Mush! <laughs> This 
is the best Inukshuk ever! Whoa! Justin! Time to go. Little dudes! Stay frosty! Bye, Atuk! Bye, Olive! <laughs> Bye, everyone! Bye! Bye! <laughs> Squinchy! Squinchy, wake up! I feel great! Squinchy, I figured out the puzzle! Really? What is it? Watch! This piece goes here. Uh huh. And that piece goes there. It does. And this piece goes right, right here. here! Look, Squinchy, it's an induction! Frosty! about to start. Yeah, let's go! <laughs> Drivers, start your engines! Vroom! On your mark, get set! Hey! Ah, Flat tire. Hmm. I think this car might need to see a doctor. Maybe your dad can help fix it. No, I don't need any help. It's not that flat. We can still win the race. Come on, Squidgy, let's go! Vroom! Vroom! like a doctor for cars. Cool, a car doctor! Who's the driver? I'll drive your car. Yeah, Justin's the best driver ever! Perfect. Now all we need is a name. Let's call it Blue Lightning! Blue, Blue Lightning. Lightning! Nice! Oh, oh, can I ride with Justin? I can honk the horn. I'm so good at honking. Listen, honk, honk. Squidgy's a really good honker. <laughs> Sorry, Squidgy. A race car only has room for the driver. Why don't you be in the pit crew with me? Sure! Uh, what's a pit crew? A pit crew helps keep a race car in tip-top shape. Oh, that sounds like fun. Can I use a horn? You bet. Here. I'm in the pit crew. <laughs> <laughs> and I get to drive Blue Lightning. Sounds great, Olive. It sure does. But you'll have to make sure you make pit stops during the race to keep it that way. What's a pit stop? A pit stop is when you come back here during the race to keep your car in tip-top shape. Justin, when you hear Squidgy's horn, it's time for a pit stop. It sounds like this. <laughs> I'll hold up a sign to show you why you're stopping. This one means time to stop for gas. <laughs> This one means time to stop for oil. And this one means time to stop for new tires. Right. So when you hear that and see a sign, just come over to the pit lane and pull into our blue garage. Got it. Drivers, please make your way to the starting line. The race will commence momentarily. I'd better get going. Wish me luck. Good, Good luck, luck, Justin. Justin. Excuse me. 
immediate stop. Fill her up, Squidgy. Right! Are you thirsty, Justin? No time now, Olive. I've got to get back out there. Don't worry. The other drivers all have to make pit stops, too. Every car needs gas. Okay, all filled up and ready to go. Thanks, pit crew. You're the best. Woohoo! They'll never catch me. Pit pit, on your side. On me. Wow, those were quick pit stops. Excuse me. Coming through. After a jolly good pit stop, everyone's back in the race. Red Storm is now in the lead with Yellow Hornet close behind and Blue Lightning pulling up the rear. Look out! Young chap, I'm still in the lead. Not for long. Coming through. Jolly good show. Woohoo, I did it. Justin and Blue Lightning have taken the lead again. Yeah. Excuse me, sir. We'd like to pass. Try and pass me if you can. Not a problem. Take the lead. I need a pit stop too? Not now. Hurry, pit crew. I need to get back out there. Don't worry. Red Storm will need an oil change too. Cheerio. Oil, please. Oil. Pit stop. Hmm. Huh? Don't worry, Justin. Your trusty pit crew's here to help. Yeah, let's get Blue Lightning back to the pit stop. New tires are good. You're ready to go. Sorry, pit crew. I should have let you change the tires before. That's okay. The race isn't over yet. Great. I need your help so I can win this race. Squidgy, how's the gas? Gas is a okay. Olive. Has the oil. Oil is good. Blue lining is in tip top shape. Looks like we've got some catching up to do. But you're good to go, Justin. Thanks, pit crew. You're the best.
show, Justin. Excellent race, young chap. Surely could show. I couldn't have done it without my helpful pit crew. And we couldn't have done it without our amazing driver. Justin! That's my dad. We'd better go. Bye, Olive. Bye, everyone. Thanks for everything. Bye, Olive. Bye, Justin. Bye, Squidgy. Cheerio. Ta-ta! Hmm. That tire is really flat. Mm-hmm. I think Dad should be part of my pit crew. Hey, Dad! Can you help me fix my pedal car? It has a flat tire. No problem, Justin. I can fix that for you. There. You're all set. Have fun. Thanks, Dad. Ready to go, Squidgy? Ready to go! <laughs> Drivers, start your engines! <laughs> Here comes the humongous Mr. Dinosaurus, stomping across the valley. Look out for Teddy Saurus Rex! Teddy Saurus Rex looks great, Squidgy, but he's no match for the awesome power of Dinosaurus Rex! <laughs> oh, hey, hi, Ozzy. Hey, boy. <laughs> whoa, whoa. <laughs> oh, no. Ozzy, stop. We're playing dino. <laughs> <laughs> no, Ozzy. Stop. You're wrecking dino land. <laughs> Ozzy, give it back. That's a good boy. Ozzy really wants to play with our toys. Dogs don't know how to play with dinosaur toys, Squidgy. Hey, do you think dinosaurs know how to play with dinosaur toys? Well, not real dinos. I wonder what real dinos played. Real dinos? Yeah, with big, pointy teeth and loud roars. And huge, puffy feet. Tup, tup. Wow! Hi, Justin. Hi, Squidgy. Olive! Whoa! A real dino! <laughs> <laughs> Justin, Squidgy, meet my pet, Rexy. You have a pet dinosaur? That's right. Welcome to the Age of the Dinosaurs! Whoa! He wants to play! <laughs> Rexy wants to play hide and seek! Great idea! Okay, Rexy. You go and hide, and we'll count to ten. One pterodactyl, two pterodactyl, three pterodactyl, four pterodactyl, five pterodactyl, six pterodactyl, seven pterodactyl, eight pterodactyl, nine pterodactyl, ten pterodactyl. Ready or not, here we come. Hmm. 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 Aha! <laughs> oh. Psst. Squidgy, look! <gasps> uh, Rexy? <clears throat> yeah, I think you're right. He says he's too big to play hide and seek. Let's pick another game then. One we can all play. How about dinosaur tag? Rexy, you have to catch all of us. <laughs> okay. You're it. Run! <laughs> <laughs> you got me. Uh, 
to chase you. I know. Maybe we can change the course a little. What should we add? See that tar pit over there? This time, we have to go over the tar pit, off the rock, around the crater, over the trees, through the log, and into the hole. <laughs> okay, Rexy. You're big and strong, so you don't need to swing so hard. Oh, don't feel bad, Rexy. He says he's just not good at mini putt. None of the games we've played have worked for everyone. When we played hide and seek, Rexy was way too big. And for dinosaur tag, he was much faster than we were. And he was way too strong for mini putt. Hmm. Oh, I've got it. The problem isn't with Rexy. It's with the rules of the games. We need to change the game so he can play. Follow me. This is one big rock. What's it for, Justin? Since Rexy's so big, he needs a bigger ball to play with. And a really big place to play. Whoa! Now that's a big mini pot course. It's not mini putt, Squidgy. It's mega putt. <gasps> this is what Rexy's gonna do. He'll go over those trees, off that cliff, up the mountain, and into the volcano. No wow. way! Are you ready, Rexy? <laughs> okay, everybody, stand back. You did it! Whoa. Wait, nice. Rexy. Just 
Kristen. We have to go, Olive. Thanks for a great day, Rexy. You too, guys. Bye, Justin. Bye, Squidgy. Bye, Bye Olive. Bye, Rexy. <laughs> Still want to play with us? We just need to change our dino game a little so you can play too. Instead of playing with dinosaur toys, we can be dinosaurs. <laughs> oh, oh, can I play too? Here you go, Squidgy. Uh, <laughs> <rah>! <laughs> Let's play dinosaur tag. <gasps> You're it! <laughs> Here are your soccer shoes, Justin. Ready for the big game? I don't really feel like soccer today, Mom. But you love soccer. I do, but our team always loses. And I want to win. Maybe today's your day. I just don't want to lose again, Mom. Well, you don't have to go. But I hope you change your mind. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa! <laughs> Hey, nice shoes, Justin. We need to get them really shiny. That won't make any difference. You're still going to lose. Well, maybe not. Maybe this time you'll score the winning goal. Me? Sure. You'll score, and the team will win. There'll be trophies and medals. I really want to win, Squidgy. Yeah, you'd win and everyone would be cheering and shouting. And here comes Justin. Shouting my name. Yeah. Looks like wrong way is going the wrong way. No wrong way. You're still in the race. You need to go that way. I guess he just wanted to say hello. And there goes Soaks McGee. But we're in a race. Sorry, he does get distracted easily. Don't you, boy? <laughs> Whoa, I see what you mean. Wrong way. You're going the wrong way again. <sighs> wrong, wrong way! And the winner of the race is Rum Tom, written by Silks McGee. And Wrong Way Jimmy doesn't finish the race again. <sighs> I really wanted to win that race. Yeah, we were going so fast. It's okay. Didn't you have fun? Yeah, but it would have been better if we won. Hmm, maybe we'll do better next time. Hi, Olive! Congratulations, Silks. You too, Rum Tum. Thanks, that was a fun race. Silks, these are my friends, Justin and Squidgy. Well, hello, fellas. Good writing. Not good enough. We didn't win. Yeah, Wrong Way didn't know which way to run. That's okay. Wrong Way's a good horse, and horses just love to run. <laughs> <laughs> and I've never seen Wrong Way come so close to the finish. You mean he's never finished a race before? No, he's such a fast horse, though. I just don't know why he keeps running the wrong way. Well, being fast isn't everything. You've got to focus and do your best. So, how do we get him to do that? Maybe you just need to get to know him better. We can help, Olive. Yeah, we'll make Wrong Way go the right way. <laughs> Good idea, little yellow fella. We'll see you at the next race. Bye, Bye Silks. Silks. <laughs> when is the next race, Olive? After Wrong Way's lunch. Wow, 
Youngway sure likes apples. Uh-huh. They're his favorite fruit. He would do anything for them. He would do anything, huh? Olive, I think we can use this apple to make wrong way go the right way. Watch! <laughs> <laughs> He really likes apples. Okay, Squidge, take this apple and go over there. Right. <laughs> hey, Justin, it's really working. <laughs> now go high, now go low, this way. See, Olive, we did it. Now we can get wrong way to focus and go the right way. <laughs> this is so much fun. Hmm, you want to run around that tree wrong way? Uh, huh? Whoops, I forgot to tell you. He likes daisies too. I guess we'll have to try something else. You're a good boy, wrong way. Let's see if this will help him focus. Oh, a hat. No, Squidgy. It's a cone. There you go, wrong way. Good idea. He won't be distracted if he can only see in front of him. Oh, how you doing, wrong way? Ready to go, wrong way? Giddy up! Whee! Hey, the cone is working! Put this hedge here. <gasps> wrong way can't see properly with the cone. And he can't race if he can't see. I guess this isn't going to work. What are we going to do now? We need to get his giddy going the right way so he can get his giddy up. <laughs> oh, <whoa! laughs> Wait! Oh! Wrong way! <sighs> now that's what I call some giddy up. <laughs> What happened? Uh, 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 That's it! Uh, What's it? Giddy up! Not again! <laughs> All we have to do is shout, Giddy up! <laughs> it's like the magic word that helps wrong way go the right way. You're right. Now we can race, Justin. All you have to say is giddy. Up. You just have to say. No, no, eh, no, 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 no. Oh. All you have to say is the magic word. Right. And now that we know the magic word, we're sure to win. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. See you at the races. Hi, Silks. Glad you made it, young feller. How's old wrong way feeling? <laughs> There's your answer. Atta boy. May the best horse win. Yeah! Let's go, wrong way. <sighs> Don't forget the magic word, Justin. Right. Giddy up. Sure looks focused. Look at them go! Yeah! We're going to win. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Whoa! <sighs> no wrong way. We can still win this race. Giddy up! <laughs> yeah! Almost there, wrong way. 
I can't believe we lost. We were so close. You might have lost, young feller, but that's the best race I've ever had in my life! It was? Sure it was! And Rum Tum thinks so too! Right, boy? <laughs> <laughs> and I've never seen Wrongway so happy. Like I said, horses don't really care if they win or lose. They just love to run! Wrongway sure loves to giddy- ah. Shh! Hmm? Oh, yeah. Right. You know, Silks, even though I lost, I did have a lot of fun. Justin! Speaking of fun, I gotta run. I don't want to be late for soccer. See you later, guys. Bye, Olive. Bye, Bye Justin. Justin. And, and good, good luck. luck. <sighs> so, what do you think? I think we'd better get going. I don't want to be late. That's the spirit, Justin. Anyway, even if we don't win, I'm going to have fun trying. Come on, Mom. <laughs> okay, coming. Thank <laughs> you.